internal gear pumps are incredibly versatile they had both thin liquid and thick substance they are effective across a wide viscosity range from 1 to 1 million centipoles these pumps can handle temperature up to 400 degrees celsius they are non pulsing self priming and can run dry for a short period liquid flows into the pump through the suction port which is located between the rota the larger gear and the idler the smaller gear the arrow shows the direction of the pump and the liquid as the liquid moves through the pump it travels between the teeth of the gears the crescent shaped part divides the liquid and helps seal the space between the suction and discharge port